happening today back in port following its first voyage in more than a year. The first Bahamas Paradise cruise ship with paying passengers returns to the port of Palm Beach. It's a milestone. Just Carbonari at the port as the cruise line's flagship vessel docked. The Grand Classica Bahamas Paradise Cruise Line ship docking at the port of Palm Beach Monday morning after its first two night cruise with about 400 passengers and more than 200 crew members since March of 2020. It was fun to go to the Bahamas. Yeah. It's beautiful. The Bahamas was awesome. Everyone on board tested for COVID-19 beforehand and required to adhere to protocols. It was very clean and wiped down and all the tables were blocked off where every, you know, other, every other seat. They were very good about it. Some saying these protocols, however, slowed services down. Nice little cruise, but it, uh, you know, a little disorganized. It was horrible. Why do you say that? Because it was just, it was so unorganized, first of all, and I get it. Like they, you know, they said this is our first time on back cruising and, um, you know, but I think they should have been more prepared. Bahamas Paradise Cruise Line telling us they are pleased with how everything went, with no reports of anyone feeling ill, but will continue to work on improvements for future sales. It was a great cruise, great experience. Yes, uh, I would say everything was fantastic because we had our teething issues. And some services were stretched, so based on the flow of the passengers, we're going to tweak some management of some venues tweak some passenger flow so that we, we don't repeat that. We're told the ship will be cleaned and sanitized before it embarks again on another cruise to Grand Bahama Island later this afternoon. Reporting from the Port of Palm Beach, Josie Carbonari, WPBF 25 News.